Hello everyone and welcome back to today's video. Today we are checking out the new London Studios resource for the custom Vinewood sign. This is a paid resource and I would like to thank the team over there for letting me review it. Very appreciated. Anyway, this works uh, standalone or any framework you're using. Um, and it allows you to customize the Vinewood server um, sign to be whatever you want. There is a 10 character limit on the top and bottom for 20 characters total, which is pretty cool. But as long as your server name isn't over 20 characters, 10 on each line, you will be all good. I like it. It just highlights at night. It is kind of whatever you want to do, really, and it's kind of cosmetic. So let's hop in game and check it out. Um, in order to download and all this, you're going to buy the resource on their site. And then once you are through purchasing it, it will show up inside of your key master. Make sure your server is set to a key from your key master so all of your assets will work. And you're going to find the custom Vinewood sign here by London Studios. And then I'm going to go ahead and click download right there. And then clicking download, it will take a moment because sometimes Keymaster takes a second to get through their servers. But there we go. We have downloaded the zip file. Open it up however you normally open up your zip files. And you can see there's a lot of stuff in here. And what we're going to do is we're going to create a folder. It can be kind of named whatever you want. I'm just going to call it Vinewood Sign. And then inside of this folder, I'm going to drag all the files that we just downloaded into there. And then you may be wondering, how do we configure this? Well, you're going to go to your config.lula file. Pretty simple. Edit it with Notepad or Notepad++. Open it up. And it is very simple. It will say your text goes here and you can change the center positions and the props if you have any different ones or custom props you want to use, which is quite cool. And you have the coordinates if you need to move those around at all. That's more advanced. We're not going to touch it. We're just going to add whatever we have here. So remember, we have a limit of 10 on the top and 10 on the bottom. So to keep things easy, I'm just going to do BGHD and then on the bottom, I'll go YouTube. Just keep it very simple. Just like that. Save the file, we are good. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna copy the name of the folder. In our case, it's fine with sign. And we're gonna go to our server.cfg file, edit with notepattern s++ plus plus plus, and add ensure the name of the resource. Fine with sign, that easy. And then when we start up our server, the way to make sure everything started up properly is just to check your console, and then make sure you see started resource, the name of the folder. In here, we're just gonna sc scroll up past LVC there, and we see Vinewood sign. We are good to go. Let's hop in game and see our custom sign. All right, we are in game here, and you can see over in the distance, BGHD YouTube is the sign up here. Very cool indeed. I like it. It's like a custom sign. Um, obviously, it's going to light up at night. Let me change it tonight. I can't. There we go. There's my view menu. Let's change it to midnight, and it's going to light up at night, which is pretty cool. I like it. Um, it fits well on the mountain. You can see it from pretty far away. So very, very, very cool resource. Great job by the London Studios team. And um, if you have problems or anything, reach out to them on the Discord. But overall, very cool resource. Uh, keep up the good work and uh, subscribe. Anyway, see you in the next video. Bye, y'all.